puckering up for the chance to win hundreds of pounds worth of cosmetics, hundreds of women across Britain took part in a competition. Interests were invited to send in their lit imprint to the Royal Society of Chemistry, where judges took a typically scientific approach in judging the nation's best lips. The aim was to make people appreciate how advances in science and chemistry have provided materials like cosmetics that many users may take for granted. For example, Lipsticks are a very complex mixture of fats, waxes, dyes, lots of pearlescent bits to make them shine. Lipsticks are very complicated to make them stick on people's lips and not on anything else. He went on to say chemists have been working for ages on this and people tend to forget about it and just apply it and don't realise where it's come from and all the hard work that's gone into it. Most took the whole thing in a good sense of humour. And by linking science with the traditional celebration of romance, the society hopes that people will learn to love science. Maybe as much as their valentine.